Hello and welcome to another perfect video. I'm your host, the king of YouTube, Pikachu Allspark. Boom! Another one is here. My... Fuck. My blocks. Racers this time, though. There's 23 pieces. It's compatible with Lego. And look, it's got this sort of car-looking thing with a... With a dude who seems to have a screwdriver on his face. Whoa, whoa what the fuck? Okay. The back. CK Brands. Louis CK is a terrible fucking comedian. Ha 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 ha. Fill me with hate comments. Or any kind of comments. Just give me comments. I want comments. Please keep packaging for future. Yeah. And then, okay, yesterday I was looking at the box. Oh, here it is. It says, Stain Advisory. Contains color pigments that may stain. Which may stain. Like, it says that in the fucking information. It's basically saying, hey, we didn't fucking paint this right, bitch. Or... Maybe it's saying, hey, this is disease paint or something. Either way, it's not saying anything good about the paint. Not saying anything good about the paint at all. And now I take this tape and I flick it at this SpongeBob. Fuck, I missed. And now I dropped it. And yeah, my big wall that I use for filming other stuff is right next to here. So, not a lot of space in this room. Okay, you fucking horse sack, I know that there's instructions. If there isn't instructions, then this video is gonna end quickly. <laughs> Nothing left in the box. So I take it, and I place it here. Anyways, let's have a view of these instructions. Just six steps again, it looks like. Yep. Now back to the instructions. Here is the bag itself. Wow, that's not a lot. If I wanted to, I could build this on camera, but I don't fucking want to. Plus, my 3DS has a time limit, so... I mean, I don't know how long it would take me, but... You know what? Nah. I'm not doing it. So, here's all the pieces. They're blue, black, a couple of yellows, some orange slants. Alright, let's build this. And in the magic of video editing, you'll see it put together. And if you... Well, actually, you'll see it put together right now. Finished. So here's what it looks like. It doesn't look that bad, actually. Let's see if it rolls. Yeah, it'll roll good. And now let's get into this so-called minifigure again. Once again, it's got one of these for a body. Like... You can't really see that, right? Let's see if holding it up to the light will work. Like... It's got this for a body, like... This thing that I could swear that I... Got in the LEGO Racers set... Like... 12 years ago. I still have to look that up. Anyways, this is the minifigure's face. The helmet does not go on all the way, as you would expect from a knockoff. This is the vehicle itself. It looks like a go-kart. No steering wheel in it, but hey, there's a built-in steering wheel in the minifigure type thing. So you know, this is not a bad set at all, although you're 
Still not going to get that much fun out of playing with it unless you're a small child, and, well, a small child would not want to take the time to build this. Or well, actually, maybe they would. I don't know. All I know is that I don't think a six-year-old would want to take the time to build their toy. really don't think Lego is for six-year-olds, but I don't know. I... I don't know. Maybe it is. Who knows? I don't fucking know. Sorry. I don't fucking know. And yeah, I guess that was it. So, let's have a look back at some of the best moments from tonight's show. This all started when that kid hurt himself doing the weasel slap. Well, I got him to come over here. <gasps> oh, good. Are we gonna beat him with a bag of oranges? Yeah! Yeah, because <laughs> yeah, that'll give us great publicity. <laughs> I also got the reporter come over. So we're gonna beat her with a bag of oranges. Yeah! You guys know what good publicity means? No. No, no oranges! Oh. Ah, <laughs> uh, memories. Good night, kids. Go read a book.